Hello everyone, Should we again. I'm going to be doing another react bill again, react bill. So this time I'm going to be reacting to, to the endorsement of his newest video that he does upload today. The video I'm going to be reacting to is called McDonald's Cheese Danish Review. Hmm, that seems really interesting. Interesting. Knowing I like those Danish, the number of number, number, number Danish shows I do like having those again. I couldn't help myself with the sweets. So now I'm going to do but before I even start with this, I want to give a disclaimer. If you do not like the content I make, the react feels, or any of the other stuff I do on my channel, if you don't like them, then don't watch and go somewhere else. Because the only thing you're doing is giving me a view, and that's the damn truth, everyone. That's the damn truth, and nothing but the truth. So yeah. So now without further ado, let's get this video right now. Let's get to it right now. Alright, so yep. it is fall. Have we officially reached fall? And you know what fall brings every year? Hmm. It brings pumpkin, it brings pumpkin spice, it brings uh, pumpkin spice lattes. Uh, hmm. But McDonald's is thinking outside the box. Huh. They're trying to give you, what are they calling this? A tasty autumn alternative, hmm. taking some shots, which I appreciate, at the pumpkin game. So right here it says it on this sticker. We have the returning cheese Danish, or I should say the returning cheese Danish. It uh, originated in the 1980s. Hmm. Yes, a long time ago. They're bringing it back a little bit of nostalgia, and they're giving you an alternative to the pumpkin. So I do appreciate that. We're going to check this out. Hmm. Cue the intro. up everyone it is the you endorsement and it is time for another review yeah. this is where i try something and tell you if you should like it or not i can be very, very persuasive all right september 15th is the official launch day of this the uh, hmm. mcdonald's uh, cheese uh, uh. danish i got it a day early oh. I didn't pull any uh, strings or anything. I just saw the poster up at my local McDonald's. Hmm. I walked in the door. I went up to the lady at the counter and I said, hey, I'd like to get one of those uh, cheese danishes. Mm -hmm. and she was all about it. She goes, they are really good. They are really good. She stressed it. So I hope uh, from her mouth to my ears or mm -hmm. to my taste buds, <laughs> here you go. You're returning cheese danish from the folks over at McDonald's. Mm -hmm. Has a nice little cupped feature right there, holding everything in. Mm -hmm. So it is uh, described as a flaky pastry with sweet cream cheese filling topped with a buttery streusel and light vanilla drizzle. Yeah, it sounds amazing. It looks amazing. Uh, Let me give it a time. smell. Or as a brother, I hate these let's time graphs, give so. it the smell test. Is that what he says? Smell test? Let's go. Oh. Oh. And me without a cup of coffee. <laughs> uh, rookie move, rookie move. All right, here we <laughs> go. Uh, returning uh, back from the 80s, Got into DeLorean, said, let's go back, yeah. and uh, here we are. Wish me luck, the cheese Danish. Oh, I forgot, to, I glossed over the price. Um, what was it? 249 259 269 or 279 I remember uh, giving her $3, and she gave me some change back. So I think it was like $269. Uh, I'll have to double check. If I can find the receipt, I'll put it up on the screen. No. All right, let's go. Let's take a bite. I'm gonna take a bite into one of these corners right here. I like it. It's a nice little. It's a nice little boat. It's a nice little uh, cheese Danish boat. Oh, yeah. All right, I've talked enough. Let's go. Let's see how you, how you like it. The endorsement. Oh. Another. 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 Uh, Jesus also has a bit of been trying it himself, which I'll be no, acting in the future. Nice sweetness to that uh, cream cheese. Mm. I don't mind this. All right. Mm. I put it in the microwave for eight seconds. Huh. I feel it needed to get a little bit of heat on it. It needed mm. to maybe soften it up a little bit because that first bite was 
It's a little too doughy for me. The flavors are on point. I enjoyed the sweetness, um, but actually, since obviously I got it at uh, McDonald's, brought it back home, only, uh, I don't know, three or four minutes, uh, but by the time I set everything up, you get where I'm going with it. Uh, so I heated it up. Let's check it out. All right, so I heated it up. Ooh, eight seconds. Let me give you one more look. One more look. All right, there you go. You can see right there, a little dense on the inside. Very similar to me of a um, biscuit. Very familiar to a biscuit. But now that I heated it up, it's got a little bit of give to it. It's got a little bit of give, and it's kind of moving around, moving and shaking. All right, mm -hmm. I'm going to go right into the middle right there. Going right into this section yeah. right there. I'd share if you were here. I would. Uh, I would just apologize for that. It's got an ad. Sorry, ad. Sorry about that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. The heck? Yeah. That brought down the disco ball. <laughs> so sweet and I love sweet and a nice texture you definitely have to heat that up a little bit could have gone for maybe 10 seconds uh, mm. but one more look at it right there plenty of the sweet uh, cream cheese I like the taste of that so what is it again streusel mm. go back to my German roots all right final bite all right so listen this is bringing me back to my time in Dusseldorf, mm. hanging out with Augustus Blue. Wow, let me clean the palate. All right, so I think McDonald's is on to something. Uh, everyone bringing out the pumpkin spice, uh, pumpkin spice latte, pumpkin spice muffin, mm. pumpkin spice cookie, pumpkin spice Big Mac. The next on the horizon. Um, I like it, it's light, it's airy. After I heated it up, it was a little bit dense uh, before I heated it up in the microwave, uh, but I really do enjoy the sweetness of that and the flavor of it. And I'm gonna tell you, I'm not a huge Danish guy. And I'm talking huh. about the food. I appreciate and uh, enjoy all the Danish uh, viewers out there uh, who might stumble across this video. Uh, but I don't know, let's give it a rating. On a scale of one to 100, with one meaning, don't even waste your money. And 100 being the promised land of I'm going to give the returning cheese Danish from McDonald's. Doesn't officially come out until tomorrow. I got huh. it a day early just for you. Let me see it. Are you going to make a decision? Are you going to eat it? Am I going to stop making hand gestures? Uh. I'm going to give this a rating. Oh. Ooh. Solid. Solid. I mean, even though I'm not a huge Danish guy, that gets like an 88. I really do enjoy this huh. option, and I will tell you this, it is available at the uh, Mick Cafe, uh, which I think started in 2020, or was it earlier than that? Uh, but not only for breakfast, this is available upside down. <laughs> the more you turn me. Uh, that is available all day, so you can get the cheese Danish all day. Thank huh. you, McDonald's, giving us an alternative to the pumpkin spice invasion. Uh, hmm. So yeah, there you go, another review. In, in the, the books. books please like yeah. comment share and subscribe also please do not forget to check me out on instagram and twitter that is social media getting the word on my channel out, out to, to the, the masses, masses. in yeah. closing um are you going to try this is this something you're going to get with your morning no. coffee do a little uh bite do well, a little really sip. Go to are you going to kind of dip it in the coffee what are you going to do do you like the danish do you appreciate the danish anything to try try that danish. try that cheese so, um all right, thank you so much, and I uh, hope you enjoyed this mm -hmm. video, and uh, we'll see you soon with some more reviews. Bye. Bye. And I'm going to be stopping the video right there. So, so yeah, that's the end of this, of this reaction film, and I hope you guys like this reaction film. I hope you guys like it. And I hope you guys do like it. If you don't, then I don't care. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And turn those notifications bells on every time I upload.
and share my feels or reject feels to your friends and family also if you want to it's your choice because I ain't making it so yeah and don't forget to subscribe to the endorsement if you're new subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet subscribe if you haven't yet subscribe subscribe and we're on the road to 2k subscribers and maybe 3k subscribers but right now we're on the road to 2k subscribers right now 2k right now so yeah and that's the end of this reaction fill and I'll see y'all for more banger reaction to come and I'll see y'all in the next time different turns out and peace out everyone